always wanted to join the army. I wanted to be a nurse. I would like to work in a safari park. Either an artist or a engineer. The, the aspirations for young people now are it's a quantum leap from when I was in left school. They've got so many opportunities or so many things that you choose from. Mind boggling. I left school in 1957, which is um, soon after the Second World War. The country was not well off then, even. Um, and I suppose uh, there was plenty of manual and physical jobs that were required and people to do them. Um, so I left school at 15. Um, and my father was already a self-employed building contractor. He had one labourer that worked with him you know, on his own. Well, then I came along, the labourer disappeared, and it was just the two of us. I was in a small town like South Morton, in North Devon, in a rural situation. There were few opportunities other than you move away to a big city to work in an office, if you've got the uh, abilities, or you worked on the farm. In, in, as a, me a mechanical engineer, which is a good job, um, or in the building construction industry. When you were Isaac's age, did you were you thinking no. I'm going to be a no. builder like my dad? No, all I thought about at Isaac's age was school holidays. The sooner they could come, the better. And we spent with my friends. I spent all my time. Which unfortunately, you kids don't do here now, and you can't for all these reasons. We just disappeared in the morning after breakfast down over the fields that I showed you where I lived. It was right in the country, which it was. And we used to spend the whole day there playing, making field camps and hedge camps and making a nuisance of ourselves to the farmers and that. And our mothers and fathers never worried a bit what we were doing. When I was there, well, you see, when you live out in the country, rural life, I, I, I never thought about it that much. Like nowadays, uh, you, well, you, you say you want to be a bank manager, pilot, whatever it might be. But uh, I think when you get, you know, from 12 onwards, you start thinking a little bit what you're going to do but uh, that's one thing I never worried about that I wanted to have been a certain thing. Well, I left school when I was 15 went on worked on with my father on the farm for 18 months then after 18 months there wasn't enough work available and I went and worked for a, a local seed merchant uh, which they handle wool and that there. Uh, I used to get the seed ready in the spring and then they sort the wool during the summer. Uh, I stuck out there and for quite a few years um, and then all the smaller devils got swallowed up really on, into one big depot into South Mountain so I came to South Mountain to work. And I worked in there for 36 years. I came in as a grader and worked my way up. For after the last 20 years of my work, uh, I was a manager, of which I thoroughly enjoyed doing. I like to have a job in a safari park or anything. Well, I like to Very good. 